Hello out there from JVC. We just wanted to make a short video to show you how to connect an Android phone or smart device to JVC's KWV30BT and KWV50BT in-dash multimedia receivers using MHL and HDMI technology. The first part of connecting is pairing up the cell phone or smart device with the JVC receiver. And this is done by going into the Bluetooth menu and locating the JVC receiver inside of the phone's menu system. So once it's located and the pairing process is initiated, there'll be a confirmation on the phone's menu as well as the receiver's menu, and after that, it will be paired up. Be sure the source is set to AV off before entering the settings menu. Then select the home key on the faceplate, hit settings, hit the system tab in the top right hand corner, select app setup, select app connection setup, then we want to go ahead and change because we're going to change this to the Android configuration. Hit next, select the HDMI option, select the phone that you have previously paired with the receiver, go ahead and hit done, and then the back key to return to the AV menu screen. Now it's time to connect the smart device to the receiver. We're using a Samsung Galaxy S3 here. The Samsung devices noted in the instruction manual do require an extra part, which is the Samsung 5 pin to 11 pin MHL tip adapter. Most MHL phones do not require this adapter, however, and you can simply use the JVC KSU61 accessory to connect the phone to the HDMI port on the back of the receiver. Now that pairing and setup is complete, hit the apps tab in your source menu, then agree to the props on the screen, and after a few seconds of initialization, the process will be complete and the receiver with connected Android will be ready to use. Once again, thank you for watching, and we hope this video helped you answer some questions about connecting your Android smart device to JVC's KWV30BT or KWV50BT in-dash multimedia MHL receivers.